Abbott Junior Invitational San Diego Yacht Club 2018 in September. One good reason why you go on the water to events when you can, if you can get out on the water. We're going to be racing to the right of us here, but you can see the current is very strong in North Bay here. So the A, B's, C1's are going to be and the senior fleet are going to be out here. And you can see the concentric rings building up on the right side of the buoy. And then if you look right down in here, you see the turbulence. So it's like this buoy's being dragged to the right. The water is flowing from our right to left. And then another thing that's not as reliable is if we, let's look at this buoy across here. Buoys, the tops of the buoys will lean towards the current, opposite of what you would think. So that buoy is leaned up current. The top of it is up current. That means the water is moving from our left to right, looking that way. Now look at the land behind the green buoy and the tree up there. You can see how fast I'm moving. See how I'm lining up more with the tree right now? I'm moving at about 0.2 knots right now. Oops, now the tree is off the buoy. So we can time that for a minute. We can drop something that floats relatively heavy in the water near a buoy and we can time it and do math on it and figure out how fast the current's going. Race one, C2 fleet. We have the C2 fleet and the C3 fleet in La Playa Cove at San Diego Yacht Club and then the A, B, C1's out in North Bay. Maybe I'll get out there later. Here's Stella winning. We're very Thank close to winning. Right. Anywhere right there. Thank you. Great job, girl. That was not a foul. That was a good job avoiding that. That's okay, she's gonna roll you. Don't worry, you're still in second place. C2 fleet struggled quite a bit off the starting line. Good job, girl. Clear your air. That was fine. Still in top three. Lost your speed on that one a little bit. Just when you come out of your tax, you cannot oversheet super hard right away. You got to ease an inch, maybe two. Okay, you're going to see that her leech is very open on 5695. This is an older sail. We don't have her, you know, brand. That's a good one, but it is a little bit old. She's going too slow right now. There. Oh, that looks better. On the rail, girl. C2 fleet. Bella right there in the top five. Uh, Stella. And then there's Bella hard left winning. Nice tack. Very slow. Now we'll use those flags, that Swedish flag right there, that American flag, we'll use those as wind indicators throughout the day. It has not been extremely shifty this morning. This is all about having a flat sail because of flat water and nine knots of wind, eight knots of wind. So this is all about a flat sail inside here doing good tacks. C3 fleet. Pin in there. I think the starting line is pretty square or even. We're looking for boat 24 and boat 9969. Here's 9969, Maddie. Don't push your boom out here. You're late. Need to get moving. See all these boats ahead of you? There's Taylor way late. Okay, so just, we're gonna work on not being on port tax so late in the sequence. Here's Maddie did okay. She should say lured boat to this yellow boat. Lured boat. Telltales are flying. Good job, Maddie. Taylor. Taylor could tack out of there for clear. Race one, C2. Bella in third, Stella in fourth. 9983 and 5695. So, up when Stella got too close to the wind a couple times, Bella would have been first, but the wind did shift to the right very heavily at the end, which was okay. She sailed well. A third is just like a first. Okay, so we are gonna work on powering our sail up for the runs. It's such a short course, it's not that important. Right now, outhaul a little looser, Cunningham a little looser, but bang, pretty close to perfect. No tighter on the bang. Looks outstanding there. And Stella's on the inside, which is she wants to stay on this inside. The leader of C2 looks a little bit lifted on port, maybe little bit so I'm gonna round the right gate I think the wind is blowing more from our right which is for them is a left wind shift so this looks like that's what I think these two are gonna do nice rounding and then Stella should break off to this side 
go ahead and split since there's a gap behind. Okay, just round that one then. I do think that the right gate, that's the other one that you decide. You see boats ahead of you rounding. Oh, Stella, what a rounding. There's first place, race one, C3. Taylor comes around in second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth. So you'll see in the C3 fleets, not super important for the start. Now he's got people behind him. I see him look behind him. That's good. That's one of our big goals for this regatta is looking upwind. When we're going upwind and when we're going downwind, we look upwind to make sure we have a clear lane. Clear lanes are really something we're working really hard on right now, almost a year before next year's nationals. We really want to learn how to when to sail in clear lanes, and once in a while, sailing in bad air can actually be okay, but very rarely. Okay, here's Taylor doing fine. He's probably in the 10 range right now. Sitting a little too far back. Can't really see him right now. He's behind 9088. He's much faster. That looks pretty good. Other than sitting a little too far back, he's moving quite well. He should trim a little tighter, go down a little bit and get on the rail. He's pinching right now. You see the front of the sail luff? That's too much luffing. It's not too bad. He is feathering, so it's not too bad, but you can see the blue boat now starting to roll in. Race two, Saturday. This is twice around, so Bella did not have a great start, but it does not matter because she's sailing well. She's already in the top one, two, three, four, five, six, easy. Stella is parked right here. We are having a little troubles doing our tax and getting moving again. Now we're getting a huge header. So you guys notice how port tack is getting pushed away from the mark and 8380 is lifted up over there. So we should be tacking onto starboard right now. Yes, it's a right phase wind shift right now, right phase. So we should be tacking. Bella can stay a little bit because she doesn't have any wind, but Stella should definitely be tacking. Port tack is not taking us towards the mark at all. Here we go, race two, C3. Maddie, you are perfect in there. Oh my goodness, how perfect is that? That is 9969, 9699. Just perfect, girl. Just perfect. Now you're right on the line. Oh, oh this might be okay. We'll see how you do. Nice. They didn't call you, so head up. Here you can see a bang that's too loose right next to Bella. Hers is still a tiny bit, but his is way loose. That needs some bang on there. Okay, ooh, what is she doing? We don't sit like this. Right now, she's having to fight the rudder about uh, 10 degrees to keep the boat going straight. We need to lean that boat to windward, get that moat Get, see how the boats are healing to windward, the blue numbers? We gotta get that, get that boat healed up so we don't have so much rudder drag. Right now her boat's trying to head up and we need to make it so when we, we're not having to fight the rudder to keep it going straight. Okay, this is a long race. First lap, there's Stella, did not have a good first upwind. Bella's coming around over here somewhere. You can barely see her through there, 9983 going fast. These are the leaders, 8380. These are the leaders of C2. So Bella could be in sixth right now. Okay, how much time? Here's Taylor right here, 20 seconds. Couple boats already over early. Perfect, Taylor, good job. Sailed clean right there. Nice, beauty, perfect start, dude. Telltale's flying. Good job, dude. Nice job. That looks really good. Still doing a little wheelie. You can see the stern dragging a little, but man, that was a pretty darn good tack. You rounded with the boat 9,000, which is this guy right here. So you had a good upwind leg so far. 
and you're gaining. The good thing is, is that the leader is 8380 right there and they're all sitting on each other on a header. See how they're going perpendicular? Yeah, look at, oh, look at the flag next to Bella. It's a little bit to her left. So she's on a little bit of a lift. She's got underneath a C3 leader. That's okay. Oh, here's Stella. See how your seal's luffing too much? Got a point. Uh, and your main, your telltale stalled there. Okay, come on. We're going to come back now. Got a whole lap to go. We just got to get pointed. The goal of this La Playa series is to point towards that beach up there. Whatever tack is taking you more towards that beach is the one that you want to be on. Right now, it's hard to tell with her. I think port tack's better for her. Right now, we should be not pinching at all because we're on such a huge lift. See how we're going straight up the bay on port tack? That's a lift. Okay, go as far as you can here. Tack, tack, good. Sail a little ways. Now you gotta guess what tack's lifted, starboard. Again, coming out of your tack, just not moving. See that? Just not getting on your sail quite early enough. Okay, this is a header, ready? Go right back. Port tack's way better. So, like, oh boy, this is C3s and C2s all mixed together. There's Taylor coming around and probably fourth in the C3s. Sir, that you're coaching islands have nothing to do with the race course or any of the wheels. So we have no idea. I know 8380 is winning the C2s. <laughs> okay, the key here is now up here. Oh, look at Maddie. Yeah! Maddie's totally in the like top, easy top 10. Great rebound girl. That's our team right there. Not a great first race, and then the next race, we nail it. The boat behind us, you weren't you weren't looking up wind, the boat behind you blocked your wind. And it caused your boom to come across. You gotta look behind. Don't let people block your wind. Now he's right away. There we go. Maddie's in there somewhere. Yep. Race two Saturday. Wow, Taylor. Taylor's coming right at us on a huge lift. See how he's coming straight up? So everybody should have rounded the right buoy and get clear air and get on port tack right away. Only one C2's crossed the line. Here comes second right here. Bella's come all the way back up to third. Wow. Okay, port tack's headed. Should probably just tack one more time. Tack again, tack again, tack again. See how you're not moving? Tack again, tack again, tack again, tack again. She just lost third. Eight, two, three, one, got her. Oh, look at Stella doing fine. Stella's gonna win a race today. Okay, race two, C3, first place there. Second place there, Taylor's right in here. So he's in the top four right now. He looks good, dude. The leech looks good. It's, you don't want it any tighter. That looks really good. Now, the other boat's pointing higher, so he should let go of the tiller and let his boat round up a little bit. Up. Tiny bit up would have saved his clear air lane there. But great race, brother. Okay, let that guy tack. Oh, okay. That's okay. Nice tack. Nice tack. Okay. Oh, 8155 just won the race. Or is he C2? I'm not sure. Okay. So it looks like we're going to get fourth or fifth here. Good job.